Okay, after a good... How long have I been doing this? I think I've been doing this about an hour and a half. After a good hour and a half, I have gotten myself five chocobos, and I believe I have gotten the freaking trick to the, the gold chocobo. We're gonna find out, because this... Let's see, this thing says six. Okay, yeah, six Karaka greens. We're gonna give them to the freaking female. I think she's a great chocobo. Yeah, it's... Mm, cool. We're gonna see if this works. This is nerve-wracking, because this is my actual first attempt at doing this and I actually I had one green wrong on the mountain river chocobo and it came out the wrong gender so I am hoping to high heavens that this works okay just like the tutorial said ladies go first and then I pick the guys okay <laughs> oh fingers crossed gotta give him the zero nut okay drum roll please <laughs> I haven't even seen the gold chocobo yet, but the achievement confirms! <laughs> Show me the beautiful chocobo! Yeah! Oh, okay. So I've actually had a name for this for a while now. I've recently watched the DuckTales uh, show on Disney+, Plus, so I'm naming her after Goldio Guilt. Because, believe it or not, she has become one of my all-time favorite characters in that show. So my gold chocobo is going to be named Goldie. Goldie O'Gilt. <laughs> oh, I love it. Okay, so, for those of you not in the know... Okay, so a brief explanation on how I did this. Okay, it's a bit long. I had to feed her, and then breed her with this one, and then I had to feed her again, and I had to breed her with this one again, and out of those two, we got this one, and we got- get out of my way. We got this one, so then I had to feed the Great Chocobo and breed this one with this one again to get this one over here, <laughs> and then I had to breed this one right here, all the way down with this one here, and as you saw, that is how I got good old Goldio Guilt over here, isn't she just Gorgeous. Yes, she is. Ha <laughs> ha I have a gold chocobo. Billy, I got a chocobo. Isn't that great? You don't care, do you? Good job, jackass. You didn't hit record on the frickin' video recording. Now all that work coming out here to get ninth of the round, no one's gonna see. Good job, Sam. Hi, YouTube, and welcome back to Final Fantasy VII when we left off. I got myself a gold chocobo, and we need to get ourselves to Junon to get the final huge materia from the underground reactor. But before I do that, there are some very useful materias just floating around in caves around the area that, with this gold chocobo in tow, I can finally get to. So we're going to collect those materials because I have this overwhelming feeling they're going to help us in the fights to come. First things first that I collected, I came out here to this island right here and collected a neat little, uh, as you can see, a neat little, I said, <laughs> a neat little summon that goes by the names of, name of Knights of the Round. This is probably one of the longest summon cutscenes that they are in the game but in addition to that it has pretty much maxed out magic stat strength damage or something along those lines and it does it for like nine different knights since it's supposed to represent the knights of the round table which I believe is nine I'm not 100% sure regardless it is probably one of the most damage dealing summons of the game that's really all I was trying to get to long time to get to that hey look it's another cave what's in this one it's a blue one. What does this do? Over the course of many years, Mako energy crystallized into the materia. Quadrum, quadramagic, qua, quadramagic. Equip that to someone right now. What do I want to equip it to? Uh, restore all. Oh, does, does, it, does it attach with full cure? Oh, I have big brain. <laughs> oh God, if that works. Oh, if that works. That is going to be amazing and fantastic, and I still need to use that hole on something. 
Uh, Odin, no. Hold on, no, 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 no. Uh, counterattack. I don't need that. <laughs> okay. Oh, I gotta test that, see if that actually works. What Quadramatic does, it is, uh, allows you to cast a spell four times. And that will be extremely useful if I can actually pair that with, um, I'm blanking, with Full Cure, which is another material I collected off screen. I got that in Cosmo Canyon behind the item shop. But if I can, but if I pair that with Full Cure, I should be able to cast Full Cure on my entire party, which is not something that you can do with the All Material because the All Material doesn't pair with the Full Cure Material. Which you know, I kind of see why they did, you you can't have everything at your fingertips. You gotta you gotta put a little bit of strategy into that, and that's a lot of what I'm trying to do here. Is I'm trying to maximize my Materia capabilities, as it were. I do put thought into it. I do try to make sure that everything I need as far as recovery is concerned is in place. But on the same token, you gotta make sure you got the the right balance of both defense and offense, you know? Here's another cave. What's in here? Hit it's purple. Over the course of many years, Mako energy crystallizes into Materia. Received HP MP. Neat. What was I saying? Oh, hey, I'm good at this. Ooh, yellow one. I wonder what magic lies in this one. What are you? It's yellow. It's mime. <laughs> I like my materia. I'm gonna equip that one too. What mime allows you to do is to cast the magic that was just cast. So like if you cast a summon, you can cast that same summon without having the materia attached. I think that is super nifty. Give it. I think it actually comes with all the bells and whistles too, so if I cast something with Quattro Magic, it'll cast four of them or, so, or something along the same lines. Okay, well there's some extra materia to give us a little bit more of an edge in the fights to come. I should probably put a little bit more effort into building my materia because we've got a machine coming up as a boss and I gotta make sure that I'm prepared. Oh my goodness! I didn't realize I could get here. I thought I had to wait until I had the submarine to get here. Well, if I'm gonna be here, is Vincent on my party? Yeah, Vincent's on my party. Cool, I'm gonna go say hi to an old friend of Vincent's. Vincent. That, that voice, it, it can't be. Is that, it's Lucrezia! Lu Lucrezia? Vincent! Lucrezia! Stay back! Oh, and now we're getting a flashback. Once upon a time, Vincent Valentine, the Turk, not the vampire, was in charge of protecting the lives of three scientists from Shinra. One, Professor Gast, one, Professor Hojo, and the third, Professor Lucrezia. <sighs> What they didn't expect is that Vincent would actually develop feelings for Lucrezia, but she was very into her work, and so she wound up with Hojo, and that's what led to Vincent, is Vincent found out Lucrezia was pregnant with Hojo's child, and yeah, since it was Sephiroth's kid, do you really expect someone to seem like they're going to survive that? I'm against it. She and I are both scientists. I don't care. I'm against what you're doing. After that, a child was born to Lucrezia. That child's name was Sephiroth. And Lucrezia passed out and apparently died from giving birth to Sephiroth. And Vincent was not happy. He was actually going to cause a lot of problems for Hojo. So Hojo instead put a bullet through his skull. I know it looks like he shot him in the heart, but he actually put a bullet through his skull. But yeah, somehow Lucrezia managed to patch him up with some kind of... I know that shows Hojo doing it. Hojo tampered with him a lot. But in the end, it was actually Lucrezia who put him into a tube that saved his life but it turned him into the monster we see him today and that's why he put himself to sleep is he did not deem himself worthy of integrating back into society when he woke up a monster at least from his own perspective still a monster very much in control of himself this body is the punishment that was given to me i was unable to stop professor gast and hojo and lucrezia i was unable to stop them all that i was able to do was watch that is my punishment that's why he was sleeping for so long 
Hey, Lucrezia, are you alright? Lucrezia, you're alive. I wanted to disappear. I couldn't be with anyone. I wanted to die. But the Genova cells inside of me, they wouldn't let me. Lately, I dream a lot of Sephiroth, my dear, dear child. Ever since he was born, I never got to hold him. Not even once. You, you can't call me his mother. That is my sin. Back! Stay back! Vincent, won't you please tell me? What? Is Sephiroth still alive? I heard that he died five years ago, but I see him in my dreams so often, and I know that physically, like myself, he can't die so easily. Please, Vincent, tell me. And Cloud steps up to tell her the truth, and Vincent shuts him down. <laughs> Lucrezia, Sephiroth is dead. Vincent, you lied to her! Oh, I mean, if you want to be technical, he did die five years ago. It's not our fault that he actually is still up and about because his consciousness refused to die even though his body was pretty well obliterated. In the meantime, can we come back? Is there something? I came back with Vincent. It should be something here for me. Is there not? Okay, fine then. I see how it is. Okay, now we're actually going to get to the main focus of this video. On to the mission at hand! Away! I know we weren't much help on the last freaking mission, but we have one more infiltration mission to do here in Junon, and we don't need their help to do it. I got 10 gil. Let me on that lift, brah. Do you even lift? I lift. See, he lets me on the lift, so obviously I lift. So this is what I do on elevators in this game. I push the button, and then I whee! <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta make your own fun, you know? Uh, that's save point. Thank you. I'ma uh, take the opportunity to save my game. Hey! We need to find that underground submarine thing. Wait, didn't we actually... Yeah! We found the entrance to that submarine shop thing already. The, the underground reactor. We already have the... Where's the cannon? I have this overwhelming feeling that we're overlooking something. I may be mistaken, but... Doesn't it feel like we're missing something? I, I don't know where you're looking, but uh, from my perspective, it looks like this cannon's gone. Yeah. Hey, well, maybe at least they can get it to turn now. <laughs> we already established before that it already does turn, Sam. Don't be a dumb. Okay, so we gotta go to the underground reactor, which as far as I remember is this way. Oh, there's an entire battalion of you. Okay. All right, let's see how hard you trained. There. <laughs> Attention! Charge! And they ran away. Good. They. Well, at least they were uniform about it. <laughs> hey! That's the underwater reactor! Come back! Okay, so I need to go down here to the underground reactor. There's not a worker there anymore, so now I can go in here and uh, do a thing. Oh, good. They put in a TikTok sound. How about whoever stays alive gets to take her out? Alright, you on. But, uh, what if both of us. Whoa, don't even talk about that, man! It's okay, I'm gonna kill you both anyway, so what does it matter? I'm really starting to think I should have put the effort into getting the freaking crystal sword from Medeal before it sank. I may not be equipped enough for this next mission, but I'm overpowered. I put in about seven, eight levels. As you can see here, when I was trying to get the money together to do the gold chocobo thing, that took a lot of money. Great, they went to perfectly good Men. Wow, a guy must have written this script. No offense intended, just wow. <laughs> okay, back to work, back to work. Yeah, I'm sleepy. For Junon! So are we just going to keep fighting infantrymen over and over again until we get down there, or what is that all about? Ow! You bitch! I should give you a other. Do I have any others? I should have bought more others. God freaking... There's an other. Okay, give yourself that other. You're gonna need it. I may have to backtrack a little bit. I don't want to, but... Ugh. Can you stop shooting me for like two seconds? <laughs> I gotta go back up. Do you, do you mind taking me back up, lady? Thank you. <laughs> I gotta find a shop that sells others. And then I will come back and do this mission. You know, since we've got... Time is of the essence. And since time is of the essence, what better time is there to go shopping? <laughs> you are such a white chick. <laughs> you are a... 
interior person, I think. Or do you just- do you sell items? Please tell me you sell items. You sell materia. Fuck. Do you have anyone in here who sells items? No! God damn it. Are you a shop? You're not going to get me down, not me! Weapon mean you're not even bad customers aren't going to get me down! Cool. You have weapons. Sweet. Those are stuffs. You- you made me sad! <laughs> Okay, you doing something? Is there anyone who can sell me something? Or do I have to go to the other side of town? I probably have to go to the other side of town for that. Ding. Do you sell weapons or do you sell items? You sell weapons. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> they still have the Rufus Shinra posters up from the frickin' parade. It's weird, right? It's been like a week. No, it's been like two weeks. She had weird customers and she said that they were all killed by weapon. That is bad luck. All of your regulars were killed by weapon? That super sucks. Alright, so the same as first class hotel. No. <laughs> I don't want your 400 kill in. I want an item shop. I hired more girls after hearing that the world's coming to an end, but I wonder if I should have. I keep getting more and more in debt. I've got to get out from under it somehow. Maybe I'll have weapon help me. Wow. Wait, the nail bat is stronger than what I currently have? Are you kidding me? Really? Aren't these the, the joke weapons? <laughs> Why is the joke weapon so powerful? What the fuck? What do you sell? I used to be in Soldier. Lately, I felt like dressing up like this. I know it's out of season, but... What are you buying? Magic Shuriken. Okay, I'm gonna get one for her. Apparently, I gave nothing to Yuffie. Everyone sells weapons. I don't want weapons. I want accessories. God damn it. Not even accessories. I want others. Give me others. Please. Everybody sells weapons. Everybody sells weapons. Why? Why does everybody sell weapons? I lost skill on this transaction. Give me an airport right out of here. I need to go get Heather, so I'm going to run to the only place or the closest place that I know of that has a freaking item shop. And I think that's goes to Del Sol. Either that I can run to a North Corral. Outside Junon, please. Which of you sells others? You don't sell others? God damn you. Do you sell others? No. Of course you freaking don't. Do you sell others? I need others. I don't care about your story. I just know you don't sell others either. Well, screw all of you. I'm going to Cosmo Canyon. You remember that item shop I mentioned earlier where I got the full cure? I'm pretty sure that was in the episode. <laughs> I don't know, I talked a lot before the episode actually started, and I hadn't recorded any of the gameplay. So this place should have others. Yep. <laughs> give me all the others I can carry. Thank you. That should give me enough to get back into Junon. I am going to need the others because I am going to need the magic because I am about to go up to something that needs a lot of electricity to take down. So we're going to go do that. It is very important to do. Wait, can I go into this forest? I can! Something to do another time. I mean, having Typhoon would be absolutely fantastic for the next fight because it's another electrical summon, but... No, I don't think we have time to squeeze that into the episode and the Junon mission, and everybody's been waiting for the Junon mission. I already subverted expectations by doing Wu Tai on Friday instead. Let's do the Junon mission. We can do that for us later. Now you don't have the cannon! Okay, let's try to rush through this now. <laughs> when you don't pay your employees enough so they take bribes on the side just to keep- <laughs> just to make a living and wind up selling your elevator to a eco-terrorist group that's trying to assassinate you and protect the planet at the same time! Totally relatable, bro. Happened to me last week. Oh hey, it's one of the smoggers. I fought a lot of those in the remake. But yeah, we're back in the Junon area. Mission start again. And this time we have come a little bit more prepared than we did last time. We have more others so they can do all the magic stuff. Alright lady, I know that we've been through this twice already before, but this time, this time we're doing the real mission thing. And we are not going to finish this episode until we have finished this mission thing. <laughs> Fear me. Don't you bark at me. Uh, am I going the right way? 
I sure as hell hope I'm going the right way. Follow this pipe, why not? Why would they be hitting, why would they be leading me this way if this was not the right way? Why are we fighting an arcade cabinet? Why does it have a gun? That is not a gun. That is for rockets. Why does it have a rocket thing? Why does it have a rocket launcher? I don't like that. Oh well, we do more damage than it does. <laughs> well, it looks like fate wasn't in your favor. <laughs> oh hey, save point. I was hoping for one of these. Another one? Do I get to have more fun and run around in circles and just babble on for like ever incoherently until I invisible invisibicate into the darkness? Invisibicate. Good job, Sam. That's good Englishing. I make up words. Invisibicate. It is when you dissipate and become invisible. Invisibicate. Do not question my logic. It is flawless. So I gotta push this button now, right? Is this another elevator? Why is this a freaking is like a silo made completely of elevators? It's a water elevator and that's a little cooler, but well no pun intended, but <laughs> That does not change the fact that how many elevators does one need? You already had a tunnel at the bottom of the freaking floor of the freaking ocean. What, do we need to go deeper than, the, than the, the ocean floor for this reactor to even work or function? Or, ooh, submarines. Those look neat. Oh no, it, it, he got record balls on his hands. Uh-oh, rocket punch. <laughs> yeah, I should probably try that quadra magic. Life, full cure. <laughs> Quadra magic does make sure that it gets cats on everybody. I'm a genius. Oh, that arm's moving. I do not like that. You cannot catch me. I will not allow myself to be picked up by the likes of you. Okay, we've got one of those runner dudes, and we've got a mini tank here. Are we really worth a miniature tank? Oh no, Cloud couldn't hit it. <laughs> Good job, Vincent. Oh no, he's got darkness. He couldn't hit it before. No, he's not gonna ever, ever be able to hit it. Good thing it only does like 95 damage. Oh no, the dude just coming on me had Vincent in the face and did not do a lot of damage. Is that definitive proof that the Kamehameha doesn't do a lot of damage? Nope! Ooh, my time magic level- we more than just my time magic leveled up. A lot of stuff leveled up. Let's go see you later! We got a boss to fight. That's why they're giving me this save point right here. 6996. <laughs> nice. Oh, hey, this is built that's almost exactly like a reactor. You are not getting this huge materia. Says you! Dude, I just walked past the other guy. Why did, why did they not notice me? What the fuck? You guys are all just infantrymen. You aren't really worth our time, are you? Uh, oh well. I want to make sure everybody is prepared for this upcoming boss fight, so that is what I'm going to do. I am healed. Now Vincent shall be healed. I just totally healed myself. Okay. I didn't need to... Okay. Yeah, no. That's not what I wanted to do. Why would you do that? That is not... Ugh. Whatever. Looks like I have some modifications to make. Fan fabulous. Shinra Beta. Don't know what that is. Okay, Quadra Magic. I'm gonna put back for a moment because we need to put Quadra Magic on Lightning. Okay, there we go. Now that should work out better. It do it looks like the inside of pretty much every other reactor I've been in. So you are after the huge materia. Yeah, did you guys not notice that I have been missing for a week and a half? Or, oh, you guys are the brown variations. Oh, sh we should be worried now. They move a little faster. Don't you hells on grenade me. I will wreck your world. Yay. Stuff upgraded. Hey, 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 is this the big materia? I need the huge materia. It's it's the huge materia is up there. We need to get to it. Hey, Vincent, can you do that cloudy, flighty, flighty thing that you do in Advent Children and go up there and get the huge materia for us, please? Before that grabby arm just... Oh, thanks, Vincent. You're welcome. Oh, joy. The huge materia has now been introduced to the club.
uh... It doesn't look much bigger than the materia we find around the world anyway. That's what you think, fuckers! We're too late! Yeah, I don't think so. We've got a freaking machine to take down. Hey, Reno, did we make it? It's being loaded into this one red submarine over here. Cool. We have to commandeer that submarine. That, that's what that means, right? Because when in doubt, commandeer a submarine to shoot it down. You know, come to think of it, Reno, we've been seeing a lot of you lately. You were in the last episode, too. How are you doing? What are you doing? Help load. Oh, it's you. Cloud? Hmm. I refuse. Yay, what a tall, dark, and frickin' fair over there said. You know, you know, I don't work for cheap. Either give it to us or else. Which is it gonna be? <laughs> okay, I see where this is going. Unfortunately, I don't have time to deal with you. So in the meantime, see that machine over there? That's what's going to deal with you right now. Have fun. My priority <laughs> is the huge materia. Bye! Bye! Here comes the thing. I have intentionally overpowered- well, okay, I didn't intentionally overpower myself, I just happened to overpower myself. But this is the guy that I overpowered myself because of. He's kinda cheap in the worst possible ways. And we don't want to all do the dead thing. However, in the meantime, he is weak against lightning, and we have plenty of that. Ooh, Death Gigas! That would be the perfect thing against this against this this uh, boss battle thing because he has he has the lightning he has the lightning and then he's gonna shock this robot till it's dead. <laughs> How I did that <laughs> is what we're doing effective yet? Who has the sense materia again? I took the sense materia off, didn't I? Either that or I gave it to Vincent. It would be just my luck if Vincent has the sense materia. We're never going to know how much HP this dude has. <laughs> Oh, I can only do Rumble once. Damn it. Okay. Uh. Oh, wait, this sense. Oh, no! He picked up Cloud! Whatever is he going to. Oh, he's going to pick up. No, he's just gonna hold Cloud. Okay. Neat. His armor. Uh. I'm not doing that great, actually, <laughs> all things considered. Yes, Death Gigas. Do that attack! Just keep doing that attack over and over and over and over and over again and we will eventually win out. Dude, look at that damage! Well, at least I'm down now. Ooh, I'm gonna cast mine. Because <laughs> I might be able to do Grunge, Ra Grunge Lance over again. That would be awesome. Get two Odins in for the price of one. Praise Broden! Man, these summons really have it in for his arms. Uh, let's hope he doesn't try to do live wire. I wanted him to mimic a to, to mime Odin. Nope, he's gonna try to mime a frickin' limit break, and that's not gonna work out. Fudge! Cookies. They're delicious. Yep, there he goes. Sid cannot do the climb hazard. Okay, can Sid do Bohomuto? Probably. Ooh, this is gonna be epic. Another Mega Flare! Wreck it shit! Comet 2. Comet 2. I wanna see what Comet 2 does. I must know what this old powerful technique is. Looks like my uh, time magic has stopped now. That's kinda cool. Are uh, you ready to accept defeat yet? Your yeah, arms sure are. Are you anywhere close to dead yet? Lapis laser. Oh, that's what you started the fight with. That is a cheap move. Okay, yeah. Hyper jump, sure. Oh, this is the comet where it takes multiple hits. Okay, that's neat. And it's dead. Yay, yes! Go team! Go go hit the showers. Get, get yourself a donut. Once, once we're done recouping, we're going to go after that huge materia, but that's something we're going to have to do in the next one. <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe, and don't forget to hit that notification bell. If you like what you're seeing, if you don't like what you're seeing, if you, or if you have another game you want to see us play here on Serious Gaming, damn, the submarine! Let us know in the comments, we might actually get to it, and until next time, have a good one!
there is a way. Hold on to your horses. Let's take it from them. Yep, they, they're, they're spinning in circles over there. They must be... I have to commandeer that submarine, don't I? Battle trumpet! That's for that's for a Kate Sith! Received key item Leviathan Scales. Oh neat! That must put out the fires at uh, the 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 Wutai fire things inside that cave. I need to fight you. I will work my way through you guys and it will be glorious! 